Good morning. Today we're looking at example 3 of section 3.4 optimization of business calculus with Excel. This time we're looking at a function where the maximum is an endpoint. We've been asked to find the maximum of p of q equals 4q squared minus 1300q plus 125,000 on the interval from 150 to 300. We need to consider the endpoint and the places where the derivative is zero. We use our standard setup. I want to set things up so I have my given function. I want to be able to find both the function evaluated at q and the derivative I evaluate at q plus 0.01 and q minus 0.01 to find the numeric derivative. I look at the graph and I'm going to see I have a critical point somewhere around 170 and I have two endpoints so I'm going to need to check 150. I'm going to as I said look at 170 is the place where I suspect I'll have an answer. The derivative isn't zero there but I do my goal seek. I'm going to do goal seek starting where the derivative is zero. I'd like g6 to be zero by changing a6. And this happens at 162.25. I can look close by 162.4 and 162.6. And what I'll see is this point is actually a local minimum or I simply look at my three values that I've identified and of them we notice that the largest is one of the endpoints and so in this case I'm looking at a problem where my maximum is when Q equals 300 then I get 950,000 as my value as opposed to the examples as opposed to examples 1 and 2 where the maximum was the place where the derivative is 0 this is an example where the maximum is one of the endpoints that we had to consider thank you